which command can be used to provide various information on the query plans used by a MongoDB query. The explain command can be used for this information. The possible modes are query planner, execution states, and all plans execution. Can you run multiple JavaScript operations in a single MongoDB instance? Yes, the V8 JavaScript engine added in 2.4 allows multiple JavaScript operations to run at the same time. What is GridFS? GridFS is a specification for storing and retrieving files that exceed the BSON document size limit of 16 MB. Instead of storing a file in a single document, GridFS divides a file into parts or chunks and stores each of those chunks as a separate document. How can concurrency affect replica sets primary? In replication, when MongoDB writes to a collection on the primary, MongoDB also writes to the primary's oplog, which is a special collection in the local database. Therefore, MongoDB must log both the collection's database and the local database. Can one MongoDB operation log more than one databases? If yes, how? Yes, operations like copy database, repair database, etc. can log more than one databases involved. How can you isolate your cursors from intervening with the right operations? You can use the snapshot method on a cursor to isolate the operation for a very specific case. Snapshot method traverses the index on the field and guarantees that the query will return each document no more than once. How, how does MongoDB provide concurrency? MongoDB uses reader-writer logs that allows concurrent readers shared access to a resource, such a database or a collection, but give exclusive access to a single write operation. Can you configure the cache size for Wired Tiger and how? For the Wired Tiger storage engine, you can specify the maximum size of the cache that Wired Tiger will use for all data. This can be done using storage.wiredtiger.engineconfig.cache size options. Can you configure the cache size for MMAP v1 and how? No. MMAP v1 does not allow configuring the cache size. Mention the command to check whether you are on the master server or not. db dot is master function. How does journaling work in MongoDB? When running with journaling, MongoDB stores and applies write operations in memory and in on the disk journal before the changes are present in the data files on disk. Writes to the journal are atomic, ensuring the consistency of the on disk journal files. With journaling enabled, MongoDB creates a journal subdirectory within the directory defined by dbpath, which is data slash db by default. What is the role of a profiler in MongoDB? Where does the writes all the data? The database profiler collects fine-grained data about MongoDB, write operations, cursors, database commands on a running MongoDB instance. You can enable profiling on a per database or per instance basis. The database profiler writes all the data it collects to the system.profile collection which is a caped collection. Which are the two storage engines used by MongoDB? MongoDB uses MMAP v1 and Wired Tiger. What is a storage engine in MongoDB? A storage engine is a part of a database that is responsible for managing how data is stored on disk. 
For example, one storage engine might offer better performance for read heavy workloads and another might support a higher throughput for write operations. Why MangoDB is not preferred over a 32-bit system? When running a 32-bit build of MangoDB, the total storage size for the server, including data and indexes, is 2 GB. For this reason, do not deploy MangoDB to production on 32-bit machines. If you are running a 64 build of MangoDB, there is a virtually no limit to storage size. Why MangoDB data files large in size? MangoDB pre-allocates data files to reserve space and avoid file system fragmentation when you set up the server. When should we embed one document within another in MangoDB? You should consider embedding documents for contains relationships between entities, one-to-many relationships, and performance reasons.